I've been able to accomplish a lot in my life thanks to the great start that I got. Wonderful family and I had wonderful schools. And I've come to believe that the real power to change our world happens at the youngest ages. North Oakland Community Charter School, or as we call ourselves, Knox, is located in North Oakland. It was very exciting to find a school that had a mission that we could really buy into. The thing about Peter, his skill set is super wide. He is a retired Chevron executive. And in the crust, there are two different kinds of crust. He could be off in the Poconos, bird watching. He could be skiing in the Alps. And the reality is most of the time he is here. One minute we'll be talking about new market tax credits, funding scheme. The next thing we'll be doing is be working on some toilet valve. And that's the spirit of charter schools in general, but Peter really embodies that. As a founder, one of the things I'm most grateful for is he helped us get this site. We were renting space in a church and we knew that the time was running out. And this space came up to be leased. The rent would not be that different than the interest on loans. Peter said, why don't we just buy a building? I, don't, I didn't even think it was theoretically possible. I mean, this is not a school that has a foundation behind it. Peter's not afraid to say, I'd like you to give me a no interest, 30 year loan. Actually, I'd like you to pay part of our mortgage. <laughs> yeah. I was laughed out of two or three banks, but luckily First Republic became very enamored of our vision and loaned us money. Almost magical that it happened. Here you see all the families that are involved in the school, the parents and their children. I don't think I would be volunteering as much here as I do if it wasn't for Peter. It's kind of created a place for me to feel comfortable here. The first day I was here, the cafe had not been created yet. And Peter writes, coffee, espresso. And I've worked at a cafe and I'm like, is the idea to just provide like a sort of community meeting place? He's like, yes, but I want to turn it into an actual fundraiser. He's like, okay, you worked at a cafe, fantastic. You're now gonna run the cafe. He creates a climate where we can all have ideas and they have a chance of coming to reality. You know, he's very concerned about the use of power. He installed the solar panels. We were very fortunate to become part of a project funded by a company named NetJets. They leased our roof from us for one dollar a year, installed this photovoltaic system on our roof, 130 panels. Then we buy the electricity for them at a very, very low rate and the savings are six to ten thousand dollars a year. It goes beyond just what's in it for my son and my family. I really had never had a student who has Down syndrome, which is part of Matthew's special needs. And the remarkable thing about Peter and his wife Cindy is they've never let those special needs define Matthew. Their attitude is Matthew should be treated like every other kid and that we don't put limitations on what he can do. And here's Matthew and he is at grade level in sixth grade. I believe that all of us who are involved with charter schools are able to create an opportunity that otherwise I don't believe exists in our society. And I think that aligning ourselves with an existing school and working to nurture that organization and bring it to success is something that's achievable and very, very satisfying.